Maple Grove girls hockey is back in the Class 2A state tournament for the fourth time in six years. Chaz Moot stopped by the Crimson practice this week as they get ready for a familiar opponent in the state quarterfinal round. Maple Grove girls hockey is back again gearing up for the state tournament. The Crimson fell behind 3-0 to Centennial Spring Lake Park in the Section 6-2A final. But six unanswered goals powered MG back to state. We knew we had what we had. Just kind of knowing that we have the ability to be able to come back. We've been training for this all year. I think just as a team, we knew we could win it together. And just within practice and stuff, we've gone through all the things. And as a team, we knew we could do it. And if we work together and stick to the systems, we could bring it together. Yeah! The Crimson coming to the 2A state tourney unseated, but with playing teams like Andover, Moorhead, Hill Murray, Holy Family, and Grand Rapids, just to name a few, Maple Grove is battle tested on their way to the X. At the end of the day, our kids could compete. And you know, we talk a lot about um, respecting everybody, but fear no one. We played such a tough schedule this year. I don't think the kids have any fear of whoever we play. They're just gonna step on the ice and compete and they feel they can win. Another one of those tough teams MG played in the regular season was Minnetonka. The Crimson drew the number one seed skippers in their quarterfinal matchup and learned a lot from their four to one loss to Minnetonka back in November. I just learned that we can really stick with them. Um, we shouldn't be nervous going into it. We held on for like a while, like you said, into like third period, we're still two and one. I think we just learned even kind of going back and watching some film that it truly was kind of the little things that we could do better and we've seen ourselves improve on it through the season. MG has been solid defensively all year, led by one of the best goalies in the state in Danny Strom. But Maple Grove's 21 goals scored in the section tournament proved they're a two-way team that is peaking at the right time. These last few games, they've just grown our confidence. Like each game, we just gain more and more confidence and our younger players are developing. It really helps us like motivate each other and just push each other to be better every single time. Just recently, it's kind of all come together. And we know we have Danny in goal. Grace Erickson's probably been playing the best D I've ever seen her play for the last three months. And the young kids have really started to step up and Bella Shipley's taken it to another level. And with that, the Crimson feel like they have as good a shot as any to make a run at the X later this week. In Maple Grove, Chaz Motes, CCX Sports. Find more prep sports games and highlights at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.